What's going on, everybody? I've got another tool review for you. This is the Milwaukee M18 Quick Lock with the broom attachment. I've used this sort of tool professionally before. I, I worked for a uh, snow removal company for one winter, and uh, for maintaining the sidewalks, we had a steel gas-powered uh, broom kind of like this, kind of like the weed whacker with the broom on the end of it. And I really uh, enjoyed using that. Um, it was excellent for clearing like a sidewalk sized area, had a good amount of power. So I had uh, moderately high hopes for this uh, M18 uh, broom attachment here. I knew that it wasn't gonna be a monster thrower like a snowblower, but I just wanted something small and light that I could uh, carry around in my vehicle and not have to like lug around a big uh, you know, gas powered snowblower. So I think this was 279 bucks for the attachment from Home Depot. Um, but here's the review, and uh, stay tuned in the middle. I got a bonus, a bonus review here coming up. Continue testing out the Milwaukee Quick Lock Room Attachment, and we're also going to test out this 3000 lumen Job Smart light.
right, so this completes the review of the Milwaukee M18 Quick Lock with the brush, excuse me, the broom attachment. They also have the brush attachment, but when it comes to snow removal, you kind of got to use the broom. Uh, this is going to get two thumbs down. As you can see, unless it's light and fluffy snow, this is not going to get the job done. It can't generate enough torque. The 5 amp hour battery generates about half as much power as the 12. And the 12 amp hour battery isn't even enough to get snow over about a 10 inch hump. Once it gets above uh, the brush, it can't throw anything anymore. And it's only about 8 to 10 inches off the ground, so it's only good for light clearing. Two thumbs down, I'm afraid to say. Milwaukee, you got a dud here. You don't see it. Alright. R2, what do you think? Good or no good? What's what's better? The hand shovel or the the this one? This one costs three hundred dollars for the attachment. This costs eight dollars. I think this one's better. 